Hi, I'm Dr. Everett Johnson, and I'm the director of the Gross Anatomy Lab here at Parker University. Hi, I'm Dr. Joshua Williams. I'm Dr. Mary V. Gonzalez. Welcome to our Gross Anatomy Lab. Gross anatomy is the cornerstone of medical knowledge and is the study of human anatomy from the regional approach. Our gross anatomy lab is due to the selfless people who donate to our anatomical gift program. Our anatomical donors are always treated with respect. The donation of the bodies for education is not a new concept, but it's a widely accepted procedure in Texas and many other states. These donations provide meaningful education to our students and we are forever grateful. Our Doctor of Chiropractic students take two Gross Anatomy courses. Gross Anatomy 1 is a second trimester course, while Gross Anatomy 2 is a third trimester course. The students spend two hours at a week in a gross lab per trimester. Each course has a practical lab midterm and a final. This means that our students will be tested in the lab twice a trimester on the identification and relationships of various structures. To support student success, our instructors offer a variety of open lab hours, giving the students additional time to study. Gross Lab has been benefiting me in the fact that there is so much under the skin that we don't even realize that we get to change in effect. Taking gross has been very beneficial because you only, for me, I'm more of a hands-on learner. So opening the anatomy book, it is only gonna help me so far. But when I go in lab and actually see the cadaver, I'm able to touch it, I'm able to feel the nerves, feel the muscles, like see the orig origination and insertion points. So it's just easier to learn that way. In Gross Anatomy 1 and 2, our students learn to identify various anatomic structures, develop their visual and kinesthetic skills, as well as solidify their mental conception of a body structure. Gross Anatomy is a team activity. Students work together at a table to complete various dissections. An effective team shows up on time and they participate in each class and it ensures everyone on the team has learned the information. By working as a team, our students prepare to be part of the healthcare delivery system. In Gross Anatomy 1, students will learn about the back, thorax, neck, and head. In Gross Anatomy 2, the students will learn about the upper limb, abdomen, posterior abdominal wall, pelvis, and lower limb. By dissecting various structures, students are able to describe the musculoskeletal components of the area, identify blood supply, neurological structures, and their relationships, as well as discuss clinical applications. At the beginning of our class, our instructors will introduce the area followed by a step-by-step -step dissection instructions. Students will then join their groups and use VH dissector to guide them on locating and identifying the day's structures. To maximize student engagement in our lab, we paired dissection with VH dissector. VH dissector was built on real anatomy from the National Library of Medicine's Visible Human Project. This platform provides an integrated environment for anatomic education and reference. VH dissector provides views of over 2,000 anatomic structures. Pairing the dissections and prosections with an active learning is incredibly important for learning anatomy. Anatomy is an essential part of our students' preclinical education. At Parker, we have provided a robust sensory experience along with active learning and teaching to help our students achieve the learning outcomes necessary in becoming a skilled chiropractor. So what I would tell uh, future students about Gross Anatomy Lab is to definitely not be afraid. I know it might seem like overwhelming and intimidating at first, but it's definitely a good learning opportunity. I know the whole reason I came to Parker and wanted to become a chiropractor is the muscle aspect of chiropractics. And so being able to go in there and, and see like exactly how the muscles run, um, where they attach, um, is the coolest part for me. 
One of the huge reasons why I chose Parker was for Gross Lab. Uh, I'm a huge hands-on learner, so getting that opportunity to be so hands-on with what I'm learning was a huge reason. And we want to welcome you to Gross Anatomy Lab.